Hi guys, um, it's your girl Nubia in here. Today I'm back with a video, um, more like a review for the She Is Bomb collection. I do have the Bomb Goo and the Blending Wax. And basically in this video, I'm just going to be showing me using it. I did try it out before I made this video. So I do know that the hold for the goo lasts really long. But don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Share this video with your friends. Um, don't forget to follow me on Instagram at prettygang underscore nubia. There will be a lot more videos to come. I hope you guys like my new background and my lights. I have some more coming in the mail soon. So hopefully my video quality will start getting better. Um, but without further ado, let's get right into this video. I'm just gonna undo my twist the first thing that I'm gonna do is apply some heat protectant to my hair that's just Tresemme heat protectant I'm gonna set my flat iron to 450 degrees and then the first thing that I'm gonna do I'm just gonna Take the blending wax and I'm gonna put it all over my leave out, the part that I'm gonna be flat ironing, so that it will blend in with the extensions. I'm just gonna take a separate section, a smaller section, so it'll be easier for me to flat iron. I'm gonna comb it out, make sure that there are no tangles. And then I'm gonna take my flat iron and just flat iron my hair as normal. As you can see, my hair is really flat. In old pictures, you'll see that before I was using the wax, my hair was really puffy because I have really thick hair. But the, the goo and the wax work really well for my hair. My hair was extremely flat and I didn't have any problem with it blending in with my extensions. I'm just gonna take a smaller section to make sure that the roots of my hair are flat ironed because in this part, my hair is wavy in the roots. So I'm gonna undo the twist for my edges so that I can flat iron them and get them to blend in with the extensions. Just gonna apply the wax stick all over the piece. Then I'm gonna comb it out and take my flat iron and flat iron the ends of my hair. I didn't really do the roots because it's hard for me to grab my edges. So I'm just gonna try to lay those down with the She's Bomb Goo. So I'm just gonna brush it so that it'll blend in and make sure that my track and the top is covered. So next I'm gonna do the other side. I'm basically just gonna be doing the same thing. I'm going to just be applying the wax all over my leave out. through then I'm gonna take the flat iron and flat iron that piece as you can see I only had to do one pass and my hair had already gotten straight but I do like to make sure my roots are straight so I do take a smaller piece and do the roots So I'm gonna take my comb and comb it so it'll blend in. 
Next, I'm gonna take my other edge piece and I'm gonna undo the twist. I'm gonna apply the wax again to this side. Comb it through. And flatter my hair. This wax is really good for blending. It works really well for me. I'm just brushing my hair to make sure my tracks are covered. As you can see, my hair is really flat. This is not a weave. It's a U-part wig that I purchased from Love Me Hair. I have a video on my channel already that is reviewing this hair. So next thing that I'm going to do, I'm going to do my edges. As you can see, my edges aren't flat ironed, it's just my natural edges. I'm going to take the bomb goo, I'm going to take a little and put it on my finger. Just a little because a little goes a long way. I'm going to take it and put it on my edges. And then I'm going to grab my edge brush and I'm going to brush that in and make a swooping motion, swooping it back. I'm not the best at doing edges, but I tried my best. Um, everything worked out really well though for this gel. It didn't flake on me. One thing I did want to know about when I made this order, it did come fairly quickly. It came in three to four days. This is probably some of the best edge control that I've ever had. Usually I use Eben, but I have to reply, reapply it every single morning. And for this to last two days, and I'm only using a very little amount, this gel is amazing. I would like to try their edge control because my hair does wave up when it has gel and it's really hard for me to flat iron my edges because they're so small. So I really want to try their edge control so my hair doesn't wave up. I'm just going to brush that in and try to swoop it as best as possible. Then next, I'm going to take the wax and put it at the top of my hair for the flyaways. And then I'm going to brush that in. So it's really just self-explanatory. I'm going to fast forward the next part and do the same thing on the other side. My light had cut off, so I had to go ahead and replug it. It had got unplugged. But I'm basically just doing the same thing on both sides.
Next thing I'm gonna do is just put my head scarf on and I'm gonna try to tie it fairly tight so that my edges will lay flat and I'm gonna leave it on there for 10 minutes. of letting my hair sit underneath the headscarf. Um, these are my results. I'm not the best at edges, um, especially with gel. So, but they are holding really well. Um, I did use this for it and my edges laid down for two days, which is really good because normally I use even, but I have to reapply it every day when I do my hair. Um, the blending wax worked really well to flatten my hair. Usually when I wear on your part wig, my hair be a little puffy because I do have really thick hair. So it's really hard for me to flat iron it and get it completely straight. But the wax did a great job. I plan on purchasing from She Is Bomb Collection again very soon. I want to try their air control because I heard it's really good. Um, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Um, don't forget to share this video and follow me. Instagram at Kitty Gang underscore media. I'll make sure to leave all the links down below. And if you want to know where I got this jacket from or where I got this um, arm cuff from, everything will be linked down below. Um, I do have other videos on my channel, so please make sure to check those out. Um, if you have any ideas on what you would like me to post or anything you want me to try, please either leave me a comment down below or send me a DM. Um, other than that, have a nice day. Bye.